all right hello everyone you're welcome to my channel okay so my name is precious um right in this video we are going to be beginning a series jam mathematics the purpose is for our students who are graduates of uh, secondary schools who intend you know enrolling into one university or the other here in nigeria so jam means joint admission matriculation board all right that board is responsible for the entrance exam into our universities polytechnics and even college of education here in nigeria so when a student has passed the west african um, senior examination or the national examination council exam that's NICO for nigerians all right so that that means the student has five credits in english maths and the other three core subjects if you're a science student you should have in biology chemistry and physics okay so um, then you are good to you know be admitted into a, a university or let me say a tertiary institution and then you are expected to take an exam from this body which we call jam examination all right so and that exam actually would always consist of four subjects for science students depending on the discipline you want to choose as a course for instance you want to take up my course i studied mathematics in the university so you would have to write english maths uh, then any other two science subjects majorly chemistry and physics those were the four subjects i wrote in jam and then let's assume you want to do medicine then you'd have to write english physics chemistry and biology then you would not need mathematics but someone who wants to do any course in engineering would have to do mathematics chemistry and physics okay so including english english is compulsory for every you know every student who would uh, get into into the university or any tertiary institution all right so for you know purpose of guiding our students in these exams especially as it relates to mathematics that is why we are bringing up this series and of course it came highly requested you know many students on this channel even those who follow us on different other platforms have made requests for this all right so in this introductory video i am going to be laying down the background for what we'll be doing here what you are what is required of you when it comes to jump at mathematics you know you want to hit 100 you want to hit 90 90 something 80 something score because it is expected that you would as well bring you know when you come into the university you are going to be doing further mathematics so they expect you to build that background before entrance all right so i'm i'm going to be laying down the syllabus that is here that's what i have here in my hand and then um, at the end of the video i'm going to be giving us a scanned copy of it i will attach it at the end of the video a scanned copy of the full syllabus because you should know what is required of you the topics what we can call the course outline all right so generally generally um jump mathematics is divided the syllabus is divided into five sections all right so there are five sections uh that you are going to be tested on in math okay the number one is what we call numbers and uh, numeration okay so you can say number and numeration this now is going to include topics like number system which is going to be the first topic we will do and then you will have fractions decimals approximations and percentages all those topics you see questions from them in jam because of course you know fractions is a topic of its own decimals approximations and percentages they are all topics but the way they you know sectioned it here is just about um, four even okay so now here we have the third one indices logarithms and sorts all right then the fourth one is um, sets okay so these are the four major topics you have under numbers and numeration but like i said you know indices is a topic logarithms is also a topic and then sorts 
this is also a topic of its own all right so but then all of them make up numbers all right so when you deal with numbers everything you're dealing with in this case numbers even though when we get to indices we begin to talk about exponential equations you begin to see some algebra that's involving variables and alphabets okay so that's what numbers and numeration include now like i said there are also objectives here on these particular syllables that i have so i'm going to be scanning this and i'll put it so you have the details with you so you know what is expected the objectives that is expected the topics you're expected to cover and the objectives what they expect you to bring out at the end of your top learning of a particular topic so that you'll be able to answer the questions that's actually the essence all right so the second section is the algebra section okay so the algebra section is the second okay i will mention just a few of the topics so the first one here is polynomials okay so you know polynomials then you have variations you have inequalities and and the rest okay so why the third the third major section here is geometry and trigonometry okay these are two very large uh, branches or sections of mathematics that they are joining together as one section in jam math so you should be able to take care of that and then the fourth one is calculus okay so in our general mathematics in uh, secondary school as at my time i graduated from secondary school in 2007 uh, as at then there was no calculus in general mathematics but today you have calculus in general mathematics so you cannot say that you don't have knowledge of this so this involves differentiation integration functions limits and all of that so we are going to take care of it okay and then finally the fifth section is the statistics okay so statistics is also part of general mathematics so you don't need to do further maths to know statistics okay meanwhile let me mention some topics under geometry there you have euclidean geometry that's where we look about properties of angles and lines some of these things are already on my channel as topics but well, you know because it will relate jam and the way we are going to be doing this is that i'll be bringing jam past questions live on every section on every topic all right okay so and then like i said here we have the um, okay polygons triangles quadrilaterals circles that's where we talk about circle theorems and all of that you have mensurations mensurations they are there local and that's uh, where you talk about uh, locals and constructions and all of that coordinate geometry midpoints gradients of lines distance between points and the rest okay so all of these are under here then you know our trigonometry where you talk about trigonometric functions and the rest of them trigonometric uh, ratio sorry and then for the number four i already mentioned differentiation application of differentiation and integration so these are just the the three things you will see or four things differentiation application of differentiation integration and application of integration under application of integration you just see areas on that curve and all of that we will take care of that and then for section five you will see representation of data that's frequency distribution histogram bar chart pie chart they love pie chart a lot including bar charts all those charts histograms right the measure of location you talk about uh, mean mode median all those central tendencies cumulative frequency and the rest of the measure of dispersion permutation and combination they are all under statistics then probability is also under here so and that's the end like i said i'm going to give a scan of this and then there are also recommended books at the end of it you have um, a number of books some of these books i have like david oswago m et al all right that's new school mathematics for senior secondary school why i'm laughing is that i won this test book in a mathematics competition when i was in ss3 yes ss3 first term i represented my local government that's after winning for a number of uh, levels you know we did some levels in the local government and then i we represented the local government in the regional and the state level and then at the end i think we came third and then it gave us books and then i was given this book it's a very book sizable book very big but it's very beautiful david Osawa, that's uh, 
they were written by females, all of them. All of the authors are all females, all right? So it's a beautiful book. And then you will see others, like the series of other mass projects, project one, two, three. I think I have two and three, or one and two. Okay, yeah, I have one and two. I, I'm not sure I have the third one. I will try to get that. Okay, so all of these are going to be necessary in our journey, you know, in this particular section. Okay, so I welcome you to Jam Mathematics on Math Experience. It's going to be a beautiful run. It's going to be a beautiful journey. You will enjoy it. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe as a member. Oh, sorry, join as a member of the channel. You can join at any category as much as you can. It will help you know, take whatever we're doing to many millions of Nigerians who need help in Jam Mathematics. And then God bless you. We'll see you as we begin the next video. Bye.